could stop screening at more than 150 airports nationwide. It's revisiting a proposal to eliminate screening at certain airports. CBS 13's Dina Cupper joins us live from Sacramento International Airport with how it could change the industry. Good morning, Dina. Good morning to you, Ken. Well, when I first heard this story this morning, I thought, really, how would that work? Over here at the Sacramento International Airport, passengers are arriving for their flights this morning, and things could look very different if you didn't have to go through that TSA screening process. Well, right now, TSA screens passengers at about 440 airports across the country. But according to internal documents that CNN obtained, the agency is now considering ending security screenings at more than 150 small and medium sized airports that operate commercial flights with no more than 60 passengers. So a spokesman said that this kind of a change would be a huge shift for the Transportation Security Administration, the TSA. It was established after the attacks on September 11th of 2001, and some analysts say a 50-person aircraft would still be a very attractive target for terrorists. I think it's stunning that this is even being seriously uh, considered. So under the proposal, passengers and luggage arriving from smaller airports would still be screened before getting on connecting flights at major airports. That was one of our questions. Also, by eliminating screening at the smaller airports, TSA's recent cost analysis would estimate that the agency could save about $115 million a year. They could funnel that money to bolster security at the larger, busier airports. And so it's all a matter of taking money from one section of the pot and then moving it to another. But I'm curious to see what a lot of these passengers Passengers at the airport would think about this. How would you feel if you didn't have to go through that security screening process? Would it make you feel uneasy getting on those flights? Certainly a question that remains to be seen at this point, Ken. Back to you. Absolutely. That is a solid question indeed. Dina Cupper with the latest on the uh, possible proposal for TSA there at the airport. Dina, thank you.